How do I know what size squatty potty to get? Hey, this is Greg Inman, and uh, thank you for visiting my channel. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please share it and also subscribe to my channel. Uh, today, we're going to review the squatty potty. We're also going to demonstrate it, so stay tuned. Okay, here's my son, uh, Harrison. He's going to help us demonstrate the uh, squatty potty, and so let's get with it. Right now? This is it. I guess we're doing this for doing okay, this. Okay, this is it. Okay, what you gotta do is you first you sit down on the uh let's get ready there. You sit down on the squatty potty. And you gotta pull it out and then you get your feet up on it like that, like such. Get comfortable there, bud. Okay. And now this is the seven inch squatty potty. Oh thank you. It comes in seven inches and it comes in nine inches. We got the seven inches, the nine inches actually for people that are a little more limber and uh, advanced squatters. Uh, now, of course, we're designed to squat. Um, the Western toilet was actually created in 1596 by Sir John Harrington. And then uh, in 1775, Alexander Cummings is the one that actually created the S-trap. Now, the S-trap is designed, it holds water, and it keeps the sewer gases out of your house that way you don't smell your business after you've done it uh, of course that's the flushable toilet and then of course a lot of people think that thomas crapper was the guy that invented the toilet and actually he is not um he has about he had about nine patents uh plumbing patents um that he uh, uh, had in the plumbing industry and so people think people think that he's um uh, invented the toilet, but he did not actually. He just he improved it uh, by making the U trap and some other items, of course. And so um, <clears throat> now, why the potty squatty or squatty potty? I keep getting that wrong. Why the squatty potty? Well, uh, we are actually made to squat. We really are. Uh, I, I mentioned the Western toilet, the invention of that, and uh, with the Western toilet, um, it, it made us sit at more of a of a ninety degree angle. And we're really designed to sit at more of an angle. And the reason why is because we have what's known as the uh, puparectalis, I think it's how you say it, puparectalis muscle. Uh, Harrison, hand me that uh, real quick, if you don't mind there. Thanks, let me just. Okay, we'll okay um, the puper, puparectalis muscle, if I can even say that correctly, then um, uh, that kind of cuts off our colon a little bit. And, uh, and it, it, it kind of restricts us, it restricts your colon, but it's designed that way, actually. It's designed that way because you don't want poop just kind of involuntarily falling out of your colon when you're just walking around. Well, at a, at a 90 degree, um, it's still cut off, it's still kinked. So the squatty potty allows you to be at an angle where it's not kinked and it allows it to, you know, fall out naturally, which is really cool. There are a lot of things you have, you know, with, with us not squatting, we can have constipation, hemorrhoids, colon disease, uh, many other things. And uh, the squatty potty actually helps with those diseases. And so uh, it works great. Like I said, this is the seven inch. You can, uh, there's a link in the description below where you can uh, click and order your very own. And uh, go there right now, check it out. And thanks for watching.